Bhagavad Gita, verse 4.7 O descendant of Bharata, whenever there is a decline of religion and an increase in irreligion, at that time I manifest my eternally perfect form in this mundane world. Sar Ardavarshini When does Sri Bhagavan appear? To answer this question, Bhagavan replies with this verse beginning with Yada. Being unable to tolerate the decline of religion and the increase of irreligion, I appear for the purpose of reversing the situation. According to Sri Madhusudan Saraswati, Atmanam Shri Jami means I create the body. With the help of Yogamaya, I exhibit my eternally perfect spiritual body as if it were created by material nature. Sar Ardhavarshini Prakashikariti In each birth, a jiva who is bound by the result of his action takes a new body that is made from inert matter. But Sri Bhagavan, by his own will and through the agency of his Maya Shakti, deludes the demons in such a way that they consider his body to be an object of material creation. Sri Sugadeva Goswami has confirmed this in Srimad Bhagavatam 9.24.56. Yada yada hi dharmasya shayo vritishcha papanaha tat tu bhagavan isha atmanam shri chate harihi. Whenever there is a decline of religion and an increase of sin, Bhagavan Sri Hari manifests himself in this world. Various spiritual masters have explained the word Dharma in this verse in different ways. Sri Ramanuj Acharya has accepted the word Dharma to mean the worship of Bhagavan. Sri Baladeva Vidyabhushana has explained Dharma as pure devotion characterized by the performance of Arjuna, formal worship, Dhyana, meditation, and other such practices, as well as Varn Ashram Dharma prescribed in the Vedas. Srila Bhaktivinoda Thakur has quoted Krishna as follows, The only reason for my appearance is that I desire it. I descend of my own free will. Whenever there is a decline in religion and a prevalence of irreligion, I appear of my own accord. My laws, which govern the activities of this material world, are unconquerable. However, when in due course of time these rules become ineffective for some indefinable and indescribable reason, irreligion becomes prominent. No one except me can put an end to this disorder. I thus appear in this mundane plane with the assistance of my spiritual potency and dispel the decline of religion. It is not true that I only appear in the land of Bharata, India. According to necessity, I appear by my will among demigods, animals, birds and all other species. Therefore, do not think that I do not appear among those outside the Vedic system, such as Leja and Jaya and other outcasts. All those pitiable people also accept a certain degree of religiosity as their natural religion, Sva Dharma. When their religion declines, I appear among them as an empowered incarnation, Shakt Avesha Avatar, by investing a certain living entity with my potency to protect their religion. In India, people regularly perform their religious duties 
in the form of Varn Ashram Dharma. I therefore make a special endeavor to establish this system of religion, Dharma, among them. For this reason, all the charming incarnations, such as the Yuga Avataras, who appear in this world in every age, so as to establish religious principles, and the Amsha Avataras, partial incarnations, are seen to manifest only in India. In places where there is no Varn Ashram Dharma, people cannot properly practice Nishkama Karma Yoga or its goal, Gyan Yoga, and its highest fruit, Bhakti Yoga. Still, any tinge of Bhakti that manifests among those outside the Varn Ashram system can be attributed to the sudden appearance of fate generated by the mercy of my devotee.